Turn the curtain back. Hey, that's good work, man. Get him out of here. How do you want me to do that? Hey, hey, wait. I want him gone. No. What? We cannot do that. Of course we can do that. It's listen our show. Listen to me, please. No, you listen to me. Listen to me. Get him the fuck out of my play. I'm not gonna stand What's up there. It's a preview. Nobody gives a shit about a preview. Nothing matters until that old bat from the New York Times I is sitting on that audience opening no. night. We're getting rid of him. I don't give a shit. Shut I'm not gonna up. stand Just up. Just shut up! Shut up and listen to me for once! As soon as we announced he was taking over, the advance doubled, and that took less than a day. We can't afford to lose a preview. We can't afford to lose any more money. We can't afford to lose Mike. This has been about... This is about being respected and validated, remember? That's what you told me. That's how you got me into this shit. You're the director. Get him under control, okay? Fuck. This isn't the 90s anymore. Zipper's down. Hey everyone, what's happening? Lisa here with another Hollywood update. Sony Pictures has handed out a November 25, 2015 release date for their untitled Christmas Eve comedy project that stars Seath Rogen, Joseph Gordon-Levitt, Anthony Mackie, Lizzie Kaplan and Gillian Bell. Next up, Sam Remy has entered talks for the dramatic thriller Love May Fail. The film will be based on Silver Linings playbook author Matthew Quick's novel of the same name. That's it for today. Subscribe to keep up to date and remember, a friend in need is a friend indeed. See you next time.